Michelle, you look spectacular. You're amazing as always. D. That's weird. Bethany's upset because I said you should have given me that room. Let's make Bethany happy. Bethany, Bethany, <laughs> Bethany. <laughs> My dad chose drinking well, over his family. You know, drinking is a disease. I don't say it like that. Stop being I'm an sitting in the group. I'm Stop not going to stay out of it. Make me. It was, I dare you to call Scott. Tell him he's the love of your life. I'm not calling him because I'm not putting him on blast with girlfriend. Tim's like, you can't just be happy when it's but his terms. It doesn't no. work that way. It, it does can't. in his life. Well, it's not going to work in your life. I'm not the only one that stepped on someone's toes, Lou, because you know who was hurt? Who? Was uh, Bethany. About what? She was hurt that you were saying, why is Bethany's room being held? She's not the queen, I should have her room. When she got together with Dorinda and Tinsley, they told her, and I was like, oh my God. You know, I could see that Bethany was visibly shook up. She was hurt, she was like, what, she really? Was about the room? It's more about Dorinda, not about B. I didn't want to be in you that room. You didn't want to be in that room. If Bethany's upset because I said you should have given me that room, then well, let her be upset, thought... I don't give a shit. I cannot believe she's rolling her eyes after everything Bethany did to help her during the summer when she was basically on her flat ass, or should I say on her flat drunk ass? Wow, not cool, Luann, not cool. She just did all these great things for you, and you're so like, what? I want the fucking what does that room. have to do with the room? She just got you a lawyer. A lawyer? And she, yes, the, the lawyer. Oh, yes, like, she did do, oh, get me a lawyer. OK, no, the intervention, <laughs> right? You remember? Yes, of okay. course I remember. OK. And I and appreciate all she's done for me. The least she could do is give me that goddamn room. <laughs> If Lou wants to stay in that room, let Lou stay in the No, Bethany comes a day late and she goes, I want that room. Let's make Bethany happy. Not Lou. Let's, Let's make, make Bethany, Bethany happy. Let's make Bethany, Bethany, Bethany. Bethany. <laughs> with Bethany, I never know where I stand with her. One day she's saving my life and the other day she's bashing me over the head with a baseball bat. So if Bethany's gonna take it personally, bring it on, girlfriend. <gasps> All right, so you're gonna freak out when I show you something. Yesterday, I was in Boston in a hotel, and I was getting on the elevator, and you know how there's that little pad that has the pen next to the telephone on a console by the elevator at a fancy hotel? Yeah. On my daughter's life. This is on that pad. This what? is gonna freak. I don't get it. It's, I swear to God, Jordan, I feel like I'm making it all up. You look spectacular. You're, you're and I did amazing look good as always. Did he write like this? Tell me he wrote like this. He always said, yeah. He said, you look spectacular. I mean, and I Did looked good yesterday. D? I don't remember. That's weird. That's weird. Wow, you look spectacular. You're amazing as always. D? Look at, do you even see it's hotel paper? Am I making this up? No. Dorinda's experienced a death. I think she believes in signs. She goes to see mediums and she's open to this alternative approach. And I am not. And I'm finding that there are many signs that are unavoidable. I believe in this. This is a, a lot of effort for him to get these things to you. I know. He's not here. He's in another world. I believe in this stuff. He's here. I mean, he's he's trying to send me a message. I mean, how can, can these not be signs? Of course, part of it is you're looking and you're going to read into him a bit. But some of the signs are just so undeniably real. He just wants you to be happy. He wants you to move forward. That's okay. just gonna make Dennis happy. Okay, we're doing it. Tim's like, exactly. you can't just be happy when it's but his terms. It doesn't no. work that way. It, it does in his life. Well, it's not gonna work in your life. I am not this like bra burning feminist, but Tinsley sets women back 100 years. I don't know what to do. I am answering you the best I can. I am telling you the truth. She's put a lot of time and effort in. She's been very don't mature emotionally. Don't, don't, don't get upset. Don't get upset. We're all going through stuff, each one we of are. us. What are you afraid of? I don't think fear should be part of a thing called a relationship. Can I sit next to you? No, I'm, 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 I'm sorry. I really didn't know how sensitive it was or where the line is, and I'm really, really sorry. I really didn't know. I go through it myself. I did not really understand. You just don't seem that happy, and you seem like your relationship is in a box. He's a very different person than everybody I've ever dated. 
But is he also controlling? Ego. Yeah, he has a controlling ways about him. Yeah, it's right, but you need, you're a strong, beautiful woman. Do you need to be controlled? Like, I don't, it's not about you, being, like, it's a f***ing juggling act, and every day is a f***ing new f***ing But that headache. shouldn't be, be happy. He has to accept you That's for who you are. Oh, I love this guy, okay? Like, I don't know what else to say. Like, I, I... I have said to Tinsley, you're not driving. I don't even think that Tinsley's in the car. And she certainly doesn't even know where the car is going. It seems like it's too much pressure. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. <laughs> and it seems like you must be under a tremendous amount of pressure and stress. And that doesn't seem healthy and it doesn't seem happy. If you were my best girlfriend, I'd say, we have to pull you out of this. I want to do this Jeremy and I'm Tisha. trying to. But then you have to be a strong woman and like not let him drive. <laughs> I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. It's not fair.